All right, so in this video, we're doing Champion Gundir. Now, uh, to get to his boss room faster, I, I'm using uh, my stealth magic stuff. And uh, like with all my other walkthroughs, uh, it's New Game Plus 7, so you know the strategy works up to New Game Plus 7, and you don't need a specific build. Um, and if I sound a little bit out of it, it's because I'm falling asleep. I'm doing this at like midnight. Um, yeah. Okay. Yeah, to be honest, you don't want to be seen by those hollows. They don't exactly give you an easy time. Okay, so uh, I'm specking into lightning damage. Because, you know, it makes him a little squishy. Now, well, he pretty much, uh, oh, you know, he has many moves from uh, when you first fight him. But... Uh, they have like different hitboxes and stuff, like bigger hitboxes, especially on that move where he pulls up his th pulls up his uh, scythe out of the ground. Um, and yeah, I mean halberd, not scythe, halberd. Yeah, but he also has some new ones. They're mainly counters, and uh, he varies up his uh, attacks more to throw you off. Now, I didn't exactly gauge the distance on that move that well, so I took a few hits. Um, but when he does it, you want to roll. Like, you want to... Like, you want to roll for when he's, like, thrusting at you. You know, where I took those repeated hits, and... Uh, you want to roll over, um... His, uh... His left shoulder, you know, to your right on a diagonal. And that helps you clear, um, the attack. Now over here, I'm really struggling to heal and stuff, because I'm not exactly g getting far enough. And you know, if you get staggered, it really doesn't help. He gains distance on you if he staggers you, and it kind of resets everything. So yeah, if you need to heal, be like more than half the arena away from him. And uh, do note that he roll catches a good amount of the time. Man, I'm just getting hit over and over. Like, once his health bar, like, went, went down 50%, he went into hyper mode, basically. Yeah. Yikes. I think my animation got stuck or something, and I just couldn't um, get out in time. I don't consider this a good attempt, even though I got at the first attempt and I killed him and stuff. I just took so many hits. See, again... I... Yeah, you want to double roll for that attack, that running attack where he's charging and stuff. Like I said, roll for the thrust and then roll over his shoulder. Which is, of course, his left shoulder, which is your right on the diagonal. But, uh, you know, he's a big telegrapher, that's the thing, that should tell you, um, that, that tells you what to do about his attacks. Um, oh yeah, having the speed advantage helped a lot here too, because his big telegrapher is kind of like the Dragon Slayer armor. Um, but, uh, he doesn't really have a shield, and his attacks are a bit faster, and, yeah, you can take advantage of, uh, his slower speed with a faster weapon, like I'm doing, my, uh, Lothric Knight Sword. You definitely want to make yourself more available to roll than I'm doing in this fight, because you know, I used 13 S's so far in this uh, little squishy boss. Let's see if, wh what kind of a finish I get. It's probably shit. Yup, shit finish. God, I remember it being so buzz killed about this fight.
Okay. Kind of clutch, to be honest. <sighs> yeah, that's Champion Gundyr. Pretty depressing attempt, I'm not gonna lie. Actually, pretty much all my attempts are depressing, <laughs> let's be real here. 